Well, South African film Losing Lerato has scooped six international awards. Produced by actor Kahiso Modupe, the film was screened at the Idlewild International Festival of Cinema in California. Modupe, who also plays the lead role in the film, won Best Actor in the feature film, while his daughter, Simolo, scooped the Best Child Performance Award. The man of the moment joins us now on the line. A very good morning to you and congratulations. What an amazing success. Six awards in total, I understand. Good morning, Sally. How are you? Yes, it's six awards, and we are pretty excited. Uh, you know, the only damper to this is this coronavirus. <laughs> yes, in fact, we're, we're showing our viewers visuals of you <laughs> coming through, um, returning, all with masks on. What was it like yes. traveling at this time? I mean, we, we were pretty excited for that. I mean, we went out and we were cautious uh, as to, you know, um, you know, uh, having to shake hands and and doing all of that. But uh, I think we, we, you know, through through this thing of, of Corona, we also just gotta come out and and celebrate the good news of this world. Yeah, absolutely. And what good news it is um, for this film and for South African film. Tell us about losing Lerato and what do you think it is about the film that captured the imagination of the international judges? I think it's, it's, it's the story, you know, um, it's such a universal story because, uh, you know, it's, it's, it's a story that everyone can relate to. It's about, it's about a father who's, who's down and out and, and, and he's not allowed to see his daughter, you know, but, uh, and, and he kidnaps his own daughter to, to, to spend time with her. So for me, I think a lot of people would relate to it because then it shows that as parents, we should not use our children, you know, to fight our own battles. Absolutely. Uh, your yeah. daughter won Best Child Actor, Simolo. Yes. <laughs> How old is she? Uh, Simolo is nine. Um, she, was, she was six when we shot the film, but she's nine now. You must be so proud. I was wondering what was the bigger moment when your name was called out for Best Actor or when her name was called out for Best Child Actor? I think with all of us, we were just waiting. The biggest awards we know awards because... Uh, you know, when, when, when they call out her name, it's just, it just, it just, we just erupted, you know, and, and we just, uh, it just validated, uh, you know, our trip. And then, because our awards then came out later. Tell me something about um, South African film. It does seem to be on a growth path. How difficult is it to, was it to make this movie? You were also the producer, I understand. Yes. Look, um, it's, it's quite difficult when you're an independent producer because then you have to find everything yourself. Um, the same as with this trip, uh, I had to find it, you know, from my own pocket as well. So it's different when you when you've got funding, but I think that uh, you know it, it shouldn't be the case. You know, uh, we've got institutions like the NFEF, the, the DTI, the IDC. It should be an easy process, but. It's becoming more and more difficult for, for, for film makers and film producers to be able to go out and get funding and, and produce films. So you, you have to hustle hard every time you want to make a movie. Losing Lerato surely cements your success. Hopefully it will be easier to make the next one. Have you got something in the pipeline? Uh, yes, I do. Um, it's just that now I'm not going to risk uh, <laughs> selling my house again <laughs> to make this film. But, uh, yeah, I've got a series that is called Equilini 8 that I'm working on. Oh, okay, we're losing you there, but that certainly sounds exciting as well. Congratulations once again, Kahisa Modupe, for losing Lerato. It scooped six international awards recently at the Idlewild International Festival in California.